Hey everybody, how you doing? Hello and welcome to Beagle Brad's channel. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got Beagle Buddy here. He hadn't been to too many videos, but yeah, I definitely wanted to have Buddy in my video. For those of you that are my newer viewers, once in a while Buddy shows up in my videos and uh, it's great to have him, definitely. So did you say hello, Buddy? Oh, uh, yeah. He's like, oh, leave me alone. <laughs> He's a good boy. Here you go, buddy. Give him another little treat. But yeah, Beagle Buddy. He was a rescue dog. Yeah, he's a good boy, definitely. My wife and I rescued him. But that's not the reason you came. I know. You want to see Beatles. So I've gotten in some new Beatles stuff that I haven't shown you yet. So uh, sit back and relax. Don't fall asleep. But I do have some very cool Beatles stuff to show you. And we start off with the Beatles ruler. Look at that. Isn't that kind of neat? Yeah, I just uh, sucker for that kind of fun stuff. Um, I think it goes this way. There we go. Beatles ruler. Kind of neat. So I liked it so much I got another one. And this one is really neat too. Look at that. It's transparent. But see, I'll put it back in here, hopefully. And that's kind of the better way to keep it in there because uh, you could see it probably a whole lot easier. Put it back in there. There we go. Beatles ruler. Kind of neat. All right. First record up, Beatles Revolver. I just absolutely love Revolver. I've got multitudes of copies of Revolver. Yay. Yay. So, and then it's got the folds on it. It's very nice. Very cool. Look at that. It's got a little different at the beginning there. Kind of give it away, I guess. But this is a very nice copy. Set this over here. From Spain. So, look at that. Yeah, very nice pressing. And I've listened to this, and this actually sounds really, really nice. So, it's very clean. Very good. Beetle Brad has cleaned it up, too. And I'm happy with it. Very nice. I recently got that at a record show that I went to. Very nice. And then this is from 1989. This is new as well. For me, it's new. It's not It's not a new book. Like I said, it's from 89. But there's just a lot of very, very nice pictures in here of Paul McCartney. And I just, I really like this. I just... I'm always a sucker for great photography and, and sucker for Paul McCartney and Beatles, solo Beatles, or any Beatles book. It's kind of where I'm getting towards. <laughs> it's a lot of wording to get to that, wasn't it? Yeah, so that's really nice. And like I said, there's a lot of really great photos in here. I'm not going to show you all of them. Let's get through a couple more here. But yeah, very nice book. And I'm I was happy to get this. I just have not seen this. I've seen it from time to time online. Um, and then I got this. Where did I get this? It's like a Beatles fair or something like that we had here in town. And they had it there. And I, I that's where I ended up getting it. So, but yeah, it's, it's a real nice one to have, definitely. So, yeah. If you're out and about, you run across it, you say, hey, yeah, Beetle Brad showed that. Well, that sounded loud, but it's really just setting it down. Yeah, so, you know, just kind of showing you some different things of uh, possibilities of when you're out shopping. And this is great. This is, as we know it, the Beatles' Hey Jude album. But in the original first title, it was Beatles Again. And this is from Spain as well, this copy. So that's kind of neat. Love the cover of Hey Jude. I always thought that was a terrific cover. Or Beatles again. <laughs> See if you're paying attention. So which one do you like? Hey Jude or Beatles again? Do you have a favorite title? Would you rather one more so over the other? Just curious. And just like the other one I showed you earlier. There we go. And I got this one at a record show as well. And the two I showed you, whew, they are just really going up in price. So Beetle Brad could only get two records because they are just outrageous, man. Outrageous. 
Now this is really cool. I'm really glad to get this. This is Paul McCartney. And this is a bunch of um, promotional videos. I'm trying to trying to pick out my wording here. Um, it's basically uh, videos and stuff like that. And I've I've gotten the video of this before. Actually, I've got it on VHS and I've got it on DVD. But this one is just kind of unique because it's from Japan. And the cool thing about it is, well, I've kind of ruined it now, but it's on Laserdisc. And yes, Beetle Brad still does have a fancy dancy Laserdisc player. Ooh, boy, is that an oldie. There we go, flashing it here. Yeah, that is an oldie, that's for sure. Having a Laserdisc player, yeah, and it still, it still works. And I'm having fun and, you know, keeping my stuff on there. And here's the sheet to go with it. Very nice, isn't it? Hey, yeah, I like that. That's great. Paul McCartney laser disc. I enjoy, and I've watched it. Actually, I've transferred it to DVD in case my laser disc player is going to die next week. I'm ready, semi ready. And then I love collecting these. I've got stacks and stacks of these Beetle Bunthleys. And I know there's a lot of collectors out there who get these, and these are just neat. Um, I do have the originals as well, but these are reissues, and these were, um, like this one was done, you know, much later. Here's the date. I know I kind of went fast on that. Sorry about that. Just so much stuff to show you that it's uh, just great. But yeah, these Beetle Monthlies were just fantastic, and I, I just, I mean, there's a lot of rare photos in these. There's just great pictures in these. I mean, they're just really uh, a lot of rare, rare stuff, too. So I've always been fascinated with these pictures and articles. Don't get me wrong here. Got an itch. But you know when you get ready to do a video, you get an itch. And then there's the middle part. Look at that. In color, too. Oh, man. I kind of hope that's my thumbnail, to tell you the truth. That would be a cool thumbnail. Go like this. See if I can do this. <laughs> Gotta make this a thumbnail. There, was that cheesy? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was, wasn't it? And if that didn't come out as my thumbnail, I'll be like, okay, okay, it didn't work. It didn't do it. So, but yeah, Beatles Monthly Magazine. <sighs> Here we go. And the back of it. All right. And one is not enough. You always have to get more of these. Here's John in front of his roller, as he calls it. And I've done lots of videos. And right to the side of me, I don't know if you can see it, right here is John Lennon's uh, Phantom 5 Rolls Royce. And that is his psychedelic rolls. And I'm always, always looking for pictures. Here's the date of this one. I'm always looking for pictures of John Lennon's Rolls Royce. I'm just, just, I don't know over the top fascinated by John Lennon's roller as he called it his roller um, but yeah what a terrific Phantom 5 Rolls Royce that was painted psychedelic um, and I've got tons of pictures of it and all kinds of different things about John's Rolls but just haven't found too much more I found a couple die casts but I'm always looking for videos and stuff Ah, a great picture of Paul during the photo... Well, it's not the photo shoot. It's kind of like the video of During Help. Um, so, yeah, there's there's that. That's, that kind of could be a neat thumbnail, too. <laughs> Strike a pose. Yeah, we're doing Madonna. Strike a pose. There we go. And let's see. We have some more pictures here. But yeah, it's just a great publication. Beatles Monthlies. Yeah, I tell you, I know my people, my friends in England, you guys get them and, and thoroughly enjoy them. This is really cool. I'm glad to get this. I've had this for a little while. I just haven't gotten around to show it. Uh, it's American publication. But a nice one at that. And it's great. Got some 
very nice clean clean pictures in here for the publication of this John Paul George and Ringo so I hope everybody's doing well out there today I hope you guys are doing okay everybody doing good doing well thank you so very much for watching my video I appreciate it it's kind of fun to keep showing you of stuff I mean I just I kind of think outside of the box instead of just showing you Beatles albums after albums which is great nothing wrong with that I thoroughly enjoy showing you albums it's also fun to kind of mix it up and kind of show you some other stuff too so you know there's just neat stuff to do and show and there's just so much out there on Beatles um, so it kind of gives you a chance to kind of see some neat stuff that you probably would not buy on your own, but say, oh, yeah, I kind of would like to see it, but I'm not going to buy it. <laughs> Glad you bought it, Beetle Brad, because I'm not going to get it. But, yes, yeah, it's kind of fun to see it, right? There we go. So that was this magazine. Very nice. And I've got so many stacks of Beetle magazines. I don't know how I'm going to show them. And someday I'll have to get around to showing them. And then this is a very nice Paul McCartney book hardbound Paul book I really like this one I told you I like the other one too but this one's nice too it's got some great great photos of Paul and Linda and Paul and his dad there um, <laughs> Paul and his brother Mike nice yeah so you know it's just just some good that's just a good picture you know I just I don't know. You know, it's like John and George and Ringo. You know, I, I, they just never took any bad pictures. You know, I mean, I'm sure there's probably some real crazy ones out there, but just a lot of good pictures. But anyway, this is a great book. I'm liking it. Yep. So if you want to pause and read a little bit more of this on your own, that's perfectly fine. I know I'm kind of going a little fast, but so much to cover, and you guys have got other things to do, and so do I. <laughs> yep. But anyway, there's Paul. New. Yeah. All righty. Okay, just a couple more things here, and then we will wrap it up, as they say. Much older looking Paul. Boy, I tell you, he's really, really, really put the age on. Now that he's 80, isn't that incredible? Paul is touring and he's 80. Wow, just fantastic. Well, he's done with his tour. Uh, but yeah, 80 years old, just magnificent. Isn't that just something? Yeah, fantastic. Okay, I'm trying to find one picture to wrap it up with. And I lost my picture. You like how I stall? So there's that. Yeah, very nice, very nice. And then to wrap it up, this is relatively new, and I kept it in its plastic just for nice, but this is a Beatles Butcher of yesterday and today. Yup. So, and the nice thing is, and it kind of gave it away, the front cover, but this is really nice because this is the rainbow colored version. It's got the rainbow, side one side two but you know as beetle brad on my channel i absolutely love colored vinyl and this is just spectacular so look at that isn't that neat wow really cool huh definitely so yeah i'm really 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 happy when i got this because this was really neat so there we go this could be my thumbnail <laughs> Should I do another cheesy grin? Ah, you know. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> ah, great fun. Okay, I'm being silly now. But anyway, thank you so very much for stopping by. Thanks for watching my videos and having you here. Hello to my new subscribers. Stay tuned. I've got tons and tons more stuff to come. Oh, man, I got more and more solo stuff to show you and Beatles stuff to show you, collectibles to show you, CDs, 45s, everything you could think of. 
So, and I thank you so very much for watching. I really do appreciate each and every one of you. My older subscribers, thanks guys. Thanks for hanging in there for, with me. I've been on the, doing the YouTube videos for over five and a half years now. Whew, wow. No, no, yeah, yeah, five and a half, that's right. Yeah, it's <laughs> getting ready to say, I thought it was three and a half, but no, it's five. Yeah, woo, thumbs up. Alrighty, thank you for watching. Take care, and as I say on my channel, I'm out of here. Take care, everybody. See you on the next video.